What's up guys? It's Kayla back with another YouTube video. So today I am going to do a little bit of a first impressions. Um, I went to Gabe yesterday, which is like a little, I don't know, I don't know how to explain Gabe's. Um, it's just a, a random store that has like stuff that people, you know, had too much stuff of, I guess kind of like a Nordstrom rack, but like on the way cheaper scale. Um, anyway, I found this brush. It is called the Glam Brush. It is a rotating makeup brush. I mean, how much simpler can it get to explain? It says, Glam Brush is soft and gentle on skin, easily grasps makeup for delicate application. The rotating head blends makeup for an even flawless coverage. Achieve professional looking makeup in less time using less makeup. Um, it came with a foundation brush and a blush brush. So, we're gonna try this out today. I'm gonna use, I use my same, well, I use my uh, Maybelline Master Prime already. Um, and I'm gonna go in with my Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define Foundation and my Flower Beauty Light Illusion. Um, I also got this Lashes, it's W7 Lashes Gel, G-E-L, Gelore, like galore. Um, in black is black. It says that it's like gel volume mascara. So we're gonna try that. And I got a e.l.f. sculpting concealer brush. I don't ever, ever use brushes for my makeup, like rarely. Um, especially for my concealer, I always use a sponge, um, but we're gonna try it out today. So, if you wanna see how the rotating brush works, then just keep watching. So this is already a bust <clears throat> because I tried to put the foundation brush on and it won't fit. Only this uh, blush brush fits. I don't even know how to get it back on. So, <laughs> that's cool. Man, this is stupid. I literally, I figured out how to get the little thing out, but I can't get it back in. Man, this is so stupid. That's what you get for $4.99. Come on. Glam brush is a big ol' X X. Stupid thing. Well, <clears throat> I guess because it's not working and uh, it's 8.15, I have to leave my house by uh, about 9 o'clock to get to work. I guess I'm just gonna have to, I'm just gonna have to make it work. So I'm just gonna use the little half of it and uh, we'll go from there. We'll just rotate it like, like a brush. I mean like, like a rotating brush would, I guess. First off, no. Can you see, look at that, where I'm like trying to rub it like the 360 brush head would. It just leaves streaks. That's all it does, it leaves streaks. So, half of me wants to go, it's leaving, it's like shedding like crazy. Half of me wants to go to Gabe's again and get another one and see if it works. I'm doubting that it works because this is terrible. So I, <clears throat> so I'm just taking my Eco Tool sponge and just trying to uh, get rid of all the ugly lines that it gave me. <laughs> I didn't wet it because I didn't expect to have to use it. So, yay. I am taking my LA, <clears throat> LA Girl Pro Conceal H, 
Lifty Concealer. And just going under the eyes like I normally would. I don't think I love this concealer with this foundation. <clears throat> but I'm gonna take my e.l.f. Sculpting Concealer Brush. And it's cool because it's like a triangle. Try and read it while I do it. It says this 3D triangle shaped concealer brush it is is designed for ultimate precision to get into small crevices of the face. I could totally see how it would work well for right in your inner corner. Um, but I'm the kind of girl that I like I like things to be fast. So when I do my concealer and my foundation, I want to be like done. The soft texture and dense hairs apply product precisely and evenly, looking fin even evenly for a flawless looking finish. All right, um, you got time for that. That'll be good, like though, for like priming your eyes. But again, can I have that? I just like how fast a sponge gets it done. I'm gonna have terrible makeup today for the boutique. I'm sorry, folks, who are gonna see me today. I'm already regretting this situation. <laughs> I'm just gonna set my under eyes with the pretty vulgar um, the powder room matte about it translucent powder and I'll be right back so because I am running out of time uh, I'm just gonna time lapse you and do the rest of my makeup and when I get to the uh, mascara I'll come back and we can chit chat about it Okay, so I'm gonna do the mascara now. It is the W7 Lashes Galore Lashes Galore Gel Volume Mascara. A flat-ended mascara brush that emphasizes and lengthens lashes. The gel formula makes application smooth and simple for great looking lashes that last all day. Mm. I hope I don't have some kind of allergic reaction. That would be scary. <laughs> it's got an a nice wand though so it's kind of it is flat for sure anyway I'm gonna curl my lashes real fast okay let's apply it and see what happens I'm nervous Well, it gave me some pretty good volume and it separated them at first, but it's looking like it's gonna get kinda like spidery after a couple coats and I'm a, I'm a couple coats of mascara kinda girl. So, I've already gotten it all over me. Surprise, surprise. What's any kind of YouTube video from me without mascara all over the face? My lights are so bright that honestly, 
I can't see anything right now. Hold on. So far, I, I, I like my collab beauty mascara the best. Um, I am just going. I'm just gonna take this elf little lip. I don't even know what this is. It's just a little, I think I used it the other day actually. In praline. I'm telling you, I cannot see anything. because of that, these lights, my goodness. My eyes must be very sensitive this morning. Okay, that is it. Uh, besides having to clean up some mascara off the top of my eyes and underneath as always, um, just at this point, I'm used to it now. Um, this stupid thing, it was a bust. I mean, I'm very upset about it. It shed everywhere, number one. I couldn't even get it to like, go back in so that was annoying the mascara wasn't bad I oh I didn't I wasn't a huge fan of the concealer brush but that's because of you know I enjoy using a, a sponge for everything um, the mascara not bad it gave me oh oh my gosh it gave me some volume, but it's, it says it's supposed to last all day. Volume all day. Looking lashes, smooth and simple for great looking lashes that last all day. So we'll find out if they look great all day. I curl my lashes though a couple times during the day because I like for them to kind of be up and you can see them. Mine just kind of grow like straight out and they're very long, but they just, they grow straight out. So anyway, that's it. This thing, big fail. Big red X spray paint, <laughs> terrible. I might, I might go back to Gabe's and see if I can get another one and see if maybe that one works. Uh, but so far, I don't know. But that's it. Hope y'all enjoyed <laughs> this big old fail. I forgot I should have tried to use this as like a brush. Blush, I don't know. I couldn't. It was too big. Anyway, hope y'all enjoyed it. I hope y'all have a good day. Like and subscribe. Turn on your post notification so you don't ever miss a video. And that's all. Have a good day. See ya!